Hello, I'm Lieutenant General Todd Semini, 54 Chief of Engineers, and we're on the road again. Today we're in Wiesbaden, Germany, here in a brand new Wiesbaden High School. So with me is Colonel John Baker. He's the commander of the European District. John, tell our team a little bit about maybe about what your district does, and specifically about the DoDEA School Program. Thank you, sir. The York District is executing a program of approximately $5 billion. We're executing projects in over 40 countries, currently from 32 offices in 13 different countries. A significant part of our program is the DoDEA School Program, which constitutes nearly 20% of the volume of our work in all phases of construction. And this is an important program to us because not only is it a significant component of our workload, but our kids go to school here. And we're also a proud sponsor of Wiesbaden Middle School as one of our 30 active projects. So John, I mean, schools are very, very important to our military families. It's important that we do quality here. One of the people that on your team that really makes that come true is Mike Boyce. Mike is the DOD program manager. Mike, talk a little bit about maybe some of the mechanics of this building, some of the things it entails, and if there was any maybe lessons learned that we got out of it. Well, thank you, sir. It's uh, very proud to be partners with DODEA on the 21st Century Educational Mission here. This high school is the first 21st century school, not only in Europe, but in worldwide for DODEA. Wow. It is part one of three on this Heineberg campus with the middle school and elementary school to follow. We've learned a lot of things building this school, and we continue to work <coughs> with the principal and her team here to, to take these lessons learned for future schools. We've got about a billion dollars of active construct design and construction right now. We've engaged with our Norfolk District, who's our DoDEA Design Center of Expertise, as well as our Huntsville and Louisville Districts, who supply our furniture over here. So all together, we form part of a big family with our DoDEA customer to execute this mission. Well, as much as I like you guys a lot, I tell you, the person I'm going to probably listen the most to is the person that's got the most equity, and that's the principal. So with me today is Dr. Sandra Whitaker. Uh, Ma'am, you just walked me around for the last half an hour, showed me some amazing rooms and some great, uh, some great areas here. Uh, what do you think about your new building? Sir, we love it. We are super excited to be the first 21st century design school in Europe, uh, the first 21st century design high school in all of DoDEA. We opened this fall and we did our ribbon cutting in September. Um, the best thing about this school is the way kids love it. Uh, teachers and kids were growing into the 21st century model, but every day, every morning, the space where we're standing, wow. 200, 250 kids congregate here and they're just excited to be at school. And for me as a principal, any facility that's designed that'll allow kids to be excited to come to school every day, that gets them in the door and then we educate them. Well, thanks an awful lot. <clears throat> and as much as this really is a very, very nice facility of uh, concrete, steel, and glass, I think it goes back to uh, the people part of it. And as you were walking me around today, and I got to meet you know, the nurse, and I got to meet some of the other teachers here, I think that what Godia has, which is mainly the crown jewel, is not just great students, but great administrators and great te uh, teachers like yourself. So real impressed with what the whole district's done. Uh, normally we end it here, but tell you what, we're getting ready to go to another great school, the middle school. So I want to thank you, ma'am, for a great tour. And bottom line is, we're going to jump right over now to the middle school and show you what is the school that's still under progress look like and uh, let you know uh, what else, some of the other great things that are going on in Beastbot. So here we are in the middle school. As you can see, we've got construction all around. It's cold, it's rainy, but the bottom line, a great job by the European team here to make it happen. With me is Stephen Ross. He's the supervisor of the project managers for DoDEA. Steve, tell us a little bit about the scope of this building. Yeah, we have the middle school. It's 120,000 square feet, and it's built for approximately 540 students, and the estimated construction cost is about 30 million euros. So with us is Sabella, she's one of the brains of the operation here. We've got to be able to get this middle school done so that they can then move from their current middle school into this school. So you're under a tight timeline. I'm hearing you're going to get it done by early summer. Sabella, to our team and the Corps of Engineers, what would be one of the things that's most important of keeping a key project like this on track? Well, our effort is to all work together as a team, and that includes the construction company, the guys in the field, the Bauamt with whom we work. So the whole team is working together, and we resolve issues as we go. 
And that's the whole message I took out of this today. Both of these schools, the Europe District, everybody working side by side, Ballant, contractor, Corps of Engineers, and leadership. John, I can't thank you enough for a great job out here. And I'm telling you, I know the leaders in Dodia, they're going to be very, very proud of the schools that they're getting, proud of their teachers, proud of their students. But I'm real proud of what Europe District does for us to be able to deliver quality projects like this. Great job from Germany. Thanks an awful Thanks, lot. Sir. Sibylla, congratulations. John, well done. Out here from Germany.